Hello there, my name is Ian Schneller and I own and operate Specimen Guitar Shop and we're here with Almanac Man-Made today. <laughs> My name is Ian Schneller and I operate Specimen Products here in Chicago and have done so for the last 30 years. We've been manufacturing hornlets, hornlings and leader horns and little horns and now little horn minis um, for the last three or four years and shipping them all over the globe. So it's really been uh, hatching and, and burgeoning and I'm getting more and more interesting c commissions from various people that are just sort of turn, turning me loose to, to create and that's, that's been a really uh, gratifying uh, step forward for me to be able to follow my whimsy a little bit. So each pair of horns is crafted um, either by myself or another intern or apprentice and they all have their own kind of hand stamp on them although we're following a repetitive uh, process. I've come at these designs not so much from a theoretical mathematical approach but from more of a, a straight hands-on empirical approach. I let my ears tell me uh, when a form is, is beginning to uh, flourish and sound good. But each and every item is, is handmade, um, utilizing a ton of traditional process. You know, files, sandpaper blocks, drill presses, band saws. Um, all of these components are produced on the premises. We use some old stock tubes, but fortunately there are a lot of uh, tubes still being produced in Russia that are reasonably good reproductions of the, the tubes of yesteryear. This is technology that harkens back to the early 1940s. Uh, my amps can run uninterrupted for decades, and uh, they're completely serviceable. These are the antithesis of planned obsolescence. And this is a process that our culture has is, is gotten so far away from. Uh, you know, digital technology, while it's revolutionized a lot of our process, it's, it's pulled away from our hands an innate human understanding of materials and process. And we all, we all think that this little magic device here, this little, little uh, electronic device is uh, just going to take care of us. Um, but it's very often disposable, and even if it doesn't stop malfunctioning, uh, it will become obsolete in a couple of years because of the march of technology. It will fade down into the icy depths, just like Leonardo DiCaprio in the Titanic, you know. My concern is to, is to draw people deeper into the materials and the methodology behind the construction. That's my payback as a, as a teacher. Um, the, the music is like bait. It, it, it pulls people in and focuses their, their understanding on what's in front of them. To me, that's what art is for.